Hello, it's John Horn here with another great strategy for you. And this strategy has to deal with when you're working with a buyer that's getting ready to make an offer on a property. The first thing that I want you to start to do is to change your mindset as far as what that first offer should look like. You know, the client is going to come to you and let's say the property is listed at 150,000. They're going to come to you and say, well, let's offer 140 or 135. And your initial response, your first, very first response should be, first, Mr. and Ms. Johnson, let's figure out what the property is worth. Let me do some research to find out what the property is worth. And then that's when you as a buyer's agent, you go into full um, research mode and you start doing your CMAs to determine what Mr. and Ms. Johnson should actually pay for this property. I always like to tell people, you know, Mr. and Ms. Johnson, Regardless of price, I don't care if it's priced at a million dollars, we should pay what it's worth and let me figure that out. Let me show you what the facts are. Remember, one of the things that I teach in all of my classes is to concentrate on factual information. So then you sit down with Mr. and Ms. Johnson and you show them the facts. You show them comparable properties that have sold in that area and the house may actually be worth 160 but it's priced at 150 so that means that the seller is looking to really you know get rid of the property and they've already got it priced really low this helps you in the long run with your clients to show them look you know it's already priced at 150 the property in my opinion is worth 160 and here's why I think it's worth 160 and this is going to change the mindset of the buyer to put you in a better position to negotiate now it could be the opposite as well. The house could only be worth 130. And if that's the case, if the house is worth less than where they have it priced, which is going to be the majority of the time, um, one strategy that I like to use is to find your comparables. You put together your factual information and you send that factual information over with your offer to justify why you're only offering 130 on a property that's worth 150. Now, the reason that you're doing this is because you are actually helping the listing agent fight the battle for you with the sellers. So when you provide this information to the listing agent, the very first thing that they're going to do is they're going to take this information that you provided and they're, they're going to use that with their sellers and they're going to say, look, we got this offer at 130 and here's why they're offering 130 because of these comparable properties that have recently sold. So this strategy works, it's great, it helps to change the mindset of the seller, it also helps to change the mindset of the buyer, especially if you have the rare case where the property is priced below what the market value truly is. So I hope this uh, little tip helps you and it will definitely help you get more sales and better results.